Good Saturday evening and thank you for joining us everyone. I'm Tom Williams. We begin with a visit from Senator Roger Wicker at Naval Air Station Meridian today. He's there after problems discovered in the T-45's onboard oxygen system grounded all the trainers. Perry Robinson met with Wicker today. He has more in tonight's top story. National leaders and NAS officials look to get one step closer in resolving the recent T-45 flight issues. Recent concerns from flight instructors over the T-45's oxygen issues and safety hazards have raised several red flags on their sense of safety while in the air. Senator Roger Wicker met with these instructors at NAS Meridian to address the issue at hand. Senator Wicker says this is a unique situation unlike prior issues they've engaged in the past. It is a spike in uh, what they call histotoxic hypoxia, which is a big word, but ma mainly it's, it's a different kind of breathing problem that these training uh, pilots have not seen in the past. Senator Wicker stated that the first step in finding a solution is currently underway. A couple of these aircraft, one from here, one from another station, have, have been flown to Pax River where they get completely taken apart. The kind of analysis is going to be done that has not been done before. Naval officials have reassured their instructors that this will continue as their main focus with the best people in place to solving this problem. Our leadership is engaged. Um, we're, we're, we're laser focused on this project. It remains our number one safety priority for naval aviation. And we've got the very best people, I think, back in NAVAIR and our physiologists and medical folks to work on this problem. After Saturday's trip, Senator Wicker confirms his confidence that they'll put their best foot forward to present a safe environment for these naval instructors. This is now the top priority of uh, naval aviation. To get to the bottom of this, to solve this, we're being told that, that in this respect, uh, money is no object, that the, the necessary resources are going to be devoted to solving this problem. Reported from NAS Meridian, Perry Robinson. New Center 11.